Hello my friends, it's Caddy. I am sharing days 9 and 10 of my December daily. Um, and I uh, made one video for both of these because both of these um, little layouts were very, very simple and very quick. So um, I didn't think it would be worth it to make um, two videos for it. So basically I'm beginning with this. This paper, if you guys watch my day 8, you'll see that this paper um, I cut um, by mistake. <laughs> uh, I cut it too small. Uh, I was going to use it for my last uh, page, but I didn't end up using it, so I saved it. And it's just two pieces of pattern paper uh, stuck to each other. So it's that wood grain and then that red and green pattern paper. Uh, what I'm doing is I'm taking two uh, shipping tags. These are just from Office Depot, and I stuck them together really well with uh, my ATG. And then I'm going to punch holes in them, and I'm using the page protector from my album to guide me, uh, you know, where I need to uh, make my holes. So I just drew them out with a pencil and then I'm going to punch them out with my hole punch. Um, this is just a regular hole punch that I've had in my, uh, in my stash for years. <laughs> Probably since I was in like elementary school. No kidding. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, so I'm going to stick that, um, that piece of folded um, pattern paper to my tags and you're gonna see me do that in just a second first I'm just putting some twine through my tag and I'm actually thinking of swapping that twine out for some ribbon so we'll see if I decide to swap it out and add some ribbon up there um, so I am punching with my scallop punch a little circle to go behind my number and um, and it's a red circle and then I'm taking some of, of this gold glitter tape that I have in my little December daily kit that I put together and I am making a little banner just on the edges making a little banners banner edges I should say <laughs> and then I just place it on there and I'm just trying to get it straight takes me a minute until I'm, I'm happy with it and then I just stick my number onto the red scallop paper and then I stick that on top in the middle and then it's like a little booklet um, what I'm going to do is here, I'm going to take a piece of this striped red pattern paper and I'm going to put my photo of my little elf buddy, which is my first photo for that day. And you will be able to see it in the close-ups because that's kind of, I went through that pretty quickly. Again, like I said, both of these were very, very simple and very quick, so didn't do much to it. Um, I'm taking this cut apart sheet. This is from the Peppermint Collection by Crate Paper. So I'm taking a cut apart which I'm going to use for journaling. So I'm just cutting that apart. And I think I cut two of them because I thought I was... Oh, I do use two of them. I'm sorry. I cut two of those cut aparts and then I'm going to use one at the bottom for my journaling and then the other one at the top, which is going to hold my photos. So my photos, the first one on top is just of, um, just of the sky uh, that morning driving to work because uh, my previous layout, I journaled or I documented how it's been raining for like a week and a half and then um, this day it was bright and sunny and beautiful so I took a quick photo and I actually took a picture or snapped a picture on my phone of the weather um, my weather app but um, I didn't put it on here it just I three pictures is kind of the only space I had and <laughs> and I just use these three the second one is just of my son drawing um, because that's something he's been really into lately but I just took a picture of him drawing and then the third one is some hot chocolate that I was having that night because I was just craving hot chocolate <laughs> not because it's cold here or anything because it's not it's like 80 degrees here but um but yeah and then my pictures every time I put them facing down on my Heidi swap mat they get stuck so I have to kind of peel them off um so I'm just taking some more of that glitter tape and then I place on each um I just cut it down the middle so I could have two strips so I wouldn't waste it and then I'm just adding a piece on either side. And I just kind of struggle with it because I did put some adhesive behind my photo, but since the back of that is sticky, it gets stuck to my fingers. So <laughs> it was just really giving me a hard time. So um, I'm just decided to, to adhere it to my little um, card and then I'll just trim off whatever excess I have. <laughs> and then yeah, just to add a little bit of glitter and fun to that and then there's my little journaling card and I'm going to do the same thing I'm going to take that gold washi and I'm going to or not gold washi gold glitter tape and then I'm just going to cut it down the middle so I can make two 
and then I'm going to place one on either side to kind of match the the top portion of that and I really love making these little booklets for my December daily I think it's so much fun and it adds so much interest to your to your December daily at least I think um, you know it's I didn't just want the, the pages to be in there I want it to be interactive and I want it to be fun and you know when you're looking through it you know years from now you kind of want to open things up and it's always exciting to do that so I had a little piece of washi that I had actually thrown away because it was what I had cut off the excess so I grabbed it, I had put it in my trash, and then I grabbed it and, and I placed it underneath that red paper. So that worked out perfectly. And then I'm going to adhere this down. So that's what I'm doing right now. Just adhering the back of that to my two tags. And then I did, like I said, I stuck two tags together just to make it a little bit more sturdy. So there I go. I put it in there and then I'm going to come right back. And I'm going to start working on my day 10, <laughs> which was even more simple than this one. So there it goes. There's my little uh, pocket. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the back of that, which is the tag with the with the paper stuck to it. And then I only have two pictures for, for day um, 10. It's been pretty uneventful. <laughs> November was way, way more eventful than, than December has been. Um, I mean, I've been busy, but not, you know, like things that we've done that are interesting <laughs> so I take some of this paper this is also from the peppermint collection it's like a gold like a mustardy yellow goldish color and it has a really pretty pattern on it so I'm just trimming down a piece to stick behind this and then my two photos for day 10 are just my elf on the shelf who was in our refrigerator that day with a towel wrapped around him and then the um, the other picture is of me shopping um, me at the store so I did want to do some of my last Christmas shopping I'm just finishing up so um, I just wanted to document that that I was doing my last shopping and and um, I needed to get everything done early because I'm leaving on vacation this week <laughs> so I needed to kind of get done with that so yeah so this one's gonna be again really really simple I pull I'm um, just pulling different things to see what I want to use so I take this this little piece of red paper that I just had there in my little um, scraps next to me for my December daily and then I just cut it in half and I placed one at the top one at the bottom and I'm just gonna place my photos I'm gonna mat them on black to just make them pop a little bit more off of that paper and then I'll do my journaling for both days on the inside because I haven't done the journaling yet so I'll just journal about both days because again they were pretty uneventful so so yeah, so I just um, I'll just journal on on the inside of that on that little uh, card that I had cut apart from the cut apart sheet, and then I'm gonna take my number ten and I'm just gonna back it with some of that silver um, scallop paper. And just stick that down, and that's it. So you see, there you go, my little booklet is done. And that's gonna go in there, even though the back one is number eight as well, it's just gonna go in there, eight, nine, and 10. So that's it, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this video. Um, stay tuned for more videos coming up. Um, I hope you guys are enjoying this December daily series. And if you guys have any questions or comments, please let me know, I love to hear from you guys. So thanks again for watching, and I hope you guys are having a great December. Uh, making tons of memories with your family and friends. So I'll see you guys very soon. Bye-bye.